pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, CV. It's Montana Holly here with your morning announcements for Tuesday, February 5th, 2019. The Thunder Valley Warriors Bocce team will be hosting two upcoming home meets. They will play Thursday, February 7th at 3.30 against Ambridge and Wednesday, February 20th at 3.30 against Topol and Rochester. Please come out and support the Warriors. In addition, the CV Bocce team will be selling t-shirts this week. The cost will be $10. You'll receive a Google form in your email later in the week if you would like to order one. PMEA District 5 Band is a concert band festival held each year. Students from Beaver, Butler, Lawrence, and Mercer counties are chosen to participate. During the festival, performers must audition on their concert music to advance to the next level of festival in PMEA Region 1 Band. This year's festival was held at Beaver High School. Wendy D'Amico, Olivia McCagula, and Alex Vukovic represented Central Valley. Congratulations on an outstanding concert. Three members of the Central Valley Jazz Band auditioned on Tuesday, January 8th at Slippery Rock University and placed high enough to participate in a PMEA District 5 Jazz Band Festival. The festival was held on February 1st and 2nd at SRE. To be selected, students competed with other jazz band instrumentalists from Beaver, Butler, Lawrence, and Mercer counties. Congratulations to Olivia McCaglia, Cameron McCracken, and Mark Palumbo. That's all we have for your announcement, CB. Have a great day. Hey, CB. It's Nico and Isaac here with your sports. Tonight, boys basketball is set to tip off at 7.30 against Newcastle at home. Come support. The hockey team travels to Bishop McDowell. Puck drops at 7.15. Both boys and girls basketball play on Friday. Girls at 6 and boys at 7.30. That's all for sports, CB. Have a great day. Today will be cloudy with a high of 52 and a low of 32. Tomorrow, it's looking like we're going to get some rain at a high of 54 and a low of 46. Thursday will also include rain with a high of 59 and a low of 34. And on Friday, it's going to be partly cloudy with a high of 39 and a low of 17. That's all we have for your weather, CV. Have a great day. Brent and Isaac here to kick off your week with the 2019 Super Bowl. This year's Super Bowl was held at Mercedes-Benz Stadium in Atlanta, Georgia, where the Patriots and Rams faced off for the Lombardi Trophy. The game had a very slow start with only a field goal during the first two quarters by the Patriots. The lack of any touchdowns turned the beginning into a defensive slog. As for the halftime show, Maroon 5 performed with many of their hit songs such as Songs About Jane, This Love, and Moves Like Jagger with Big Boy rolling up soon after with The Way You Move. The halftime show also featured a brief tribute to SpongeBob creator Stefan Hillenberg. However, it wasn't what many fans expected. Squidward introduced Travis Scott falling from outer space mid-show. Because of this underwhelming introduction, many fans were left extremely disappointed by the lack of the rumored Sweet Victory performance. Here's a short clip, as well as many of their reactions. And now, a true musical genius who needs no introduction. <laughs> It's lit! Yeah. 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 Gone on you with the pick and roll. Young flame here, sickle mode. That's it? That was just a bunch of cheap sickle mode. What a rip! <laughs> Betrayed us! 
After halftime, the Rams managed an impressive 50 yard field goal. In the final quarter, however, all hope was lost for the Rams with a game winning touchdown, interception, and field goal on the cake by the Patriots at the end. The game ended 13 3, the lowest score in Super Bowl history. With this win, the Patriots are now tied with the Steelers for the most Super Bowl wins, and Tom Brady holds the record for most rings. If you're rooting for the Rams, we hope the Patriots do not deflate your week. That concludes our segment for today, CB. Have a great day.